reminds me of you when oh. you go around other people's houses. Oh, look at the face. <laughs> <laughs> I am really nice. Are you? Do your Downing you. Street. Tell them Do your Downing Street. Street story. OK. Um, well, we did this show called Jobs for the Girls and we were photojournalists in it and I had to wait outside Downing Street. It was when Norma and John Major was in. And I was staying outside with all the paparazzi, like, taking pictures of them when they come out. And Norma Major came over. She went, oh, I love birds of a feather. I said, Norma, do us a favour, love. Can I use your toilet? I've been standing out here for hours. <laughs> anyway, she let me go into 10 Downing Street. So I ring her, I go, I'm on the loo in number 10. <laughs> it's spotless in here. <laughs> <laughs> and I said to her, I said, don't nick nothing. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I always, when I go to someone's house, Peter Fincham's house, our boss's house, went to his house, checked out his bathroom, had a little look in the cupboard, see what's in there. <laughs> you, you can tell you? a lot. I'm you never inviting you to my house. <laughs> you can tell a lot about a person by what's in their bathroom, yeah. can't you? Tell how clean they are for a start. If I go to restaurants, I always check out the toilets. If the toilets are clean, you know the kitchen's going to be clean, yeah. don't you? Have you seen it? Four in a bed, there was a woman the other week, and she literally, her finger... Get, didn't careful have a which finger on. you use. She put her finger <laughs> round the, the rim finger. of the <laughs> toilet oh my and God. showed the... Oh, no. <laughs> you did through the keyhole, which is something I just wouldn't do. Oh, I Especially not it. with Keith Lemon going round you. You know he's trying on your clothes. I was nervous about him going yeah. into my house. I was cleaning for about three months before. Hiding all my Spanx knickers, hiding everything that he could take out and put on or anything. <laughs> One of the first rules of journalism, when you're interviewing somebody, if they invite you to your house, into their house, is to, go, to always ask to go to the loo, because somebody's downstairs loo always speaks volumes about the kind of person they are, cos, like, you get people who will put their Oscar in there because they know that that's the room that everybody's going to eventually yeah. go into, or what they've chosen to frame on their loo wall and stuff like that. It always, you know... And you always put it in the article. That's when really they leave the toilet rolls that's got to the end yeah. and they just leave the... Empty bit. Empty bit. That's really just annoying. strange. I think that is one of the most... Are you listening to me? My son's over there. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's irritating, <laughs> that last bit of toilet paper thing. <laughs> <laughs>